MCC 33 is upon us, so hello and welcome to the official update video, and be ready to be informed. This event will see a brand new remix along with an older remix coming back as a map instead. Starting with the first, MCC Island launched its summer event on the 27th of July, which brought the unique Sky Battle Water Fight remix. Well, it'll also be making its way into MCC 33, but with some simplifications to make it friendlier to those who might not have been practicing it. Water Fight is simple. The rules of the game are the same, but each team now starts with Water Blasters, a rapid firing ranged weapon. It's not pathetic though, water can actually kill you here, even if you just stand in it. Water Blasters come with ammo, which you'll need to reload into the weapon much like Rocket Spleef's launchers. And if you need more ammo, then just use your empty bottles on a pool of water. Differently from MCC Island's version, this remix will use a normal health system and health potions instead of towels. Okay, next up is the return of a great one. Battlebox Double Trouble was the first remix played in MCC 21 and is back for another go, but not so much as a remix this time. Double Trouble was initially debuted with the teams using tridents, but this time it'll play as a normal Battlebox map where players will have their own normal selection of unique kits to choose from. As a reminder of the rules, Double Trouble is a map that includes two capture points instead of one. To win, teams must capture both points, or when the timer ends, have the most will placed across both of them in total. Additionally, from now on, Battlebox draws will award both teams some points, which will be especially useful on a big map like this. Here's a mid-video reminder for those who don't know, while watching MCC, you can visit mcc.live to track the live stats of all the teams and scoring as the event progresses. And that'll of course activate into live mode as soon as the event starts on Saturday. You can also find a bunch of cool MCC merch at mcc.store, where we've just recently added back our legacy merch since we moved web stores, so that's available once again, but in a limited quantity, so once they're gone, they're gone. Rocket Sleeve Rush is getting an improvement, because clearly there always has to be only one winner. Sharing might be caring, but this game ain't that place. From now on, when Rocket Sleeve Rush reaches its final moments, it'll now go into overtime mode, where all the blocks start crumbling away. Where in the past you could get multiple winners, now the game will end when only one team remains. Hurrah! We're doing something super cute this weekend on MCC Island. In the center of the hub, you'll find an MCC supporter vendor where you can choose one of the 10 team mascots to support. This will give you a temporary wearable hat cosmetic so you can parade around the island and show everyone else which MCC team you're rooting for. Oh no, Stefan! We forgot about feeding the fish! What? what? What are you talking about? Oh yes, players get to enjoy a swimmingly good time in Fishbowl, a brand new map for Hole in the Wall. This brings a new platform shape and a bunch of new wall shapes too. The fish are gonna love it. Anyway, that'll close off this update video, so we'll be seeing you this Saturday the 5th of August at 8pm BST. Wait, I, I don't understand. What fish are we feeding? And, and what are we feeding them with? I think the question is who? <laughs>